What I like about CMSA is that it makes everybody a uh, part of the community and it's more than just like a school so once you get more familiar with the school it's gonna feel like your own like your secondary home. We do consider ourselves one big family. I feel like a lot of our students feel like this is definitely their second home and we created that safe environment for them. We have found that the more relationships we have with our students and with our families, the more successful that they become. I think we work really close with the parents and they really go out of their way to help us as well. We do home visits and so it's really an important thing for us to reach out to our parents and our families and build those relationships. I have a cooperation from all teachers so I can say this is school, the relation between the parents and teachers are, are wonderful. There's definitely that sense of family that we've we've definitely structured here too as far as culture goes. We've created a culture where the students are very respectful. We really focus on STEM here at CMSA. Freshman and sophomore year we speak a lot about just the college path and what it means to go to college. Junior year we do a lot of work with the students. We're preparing them for the used to be ACT, now SAT. And then senior year, college applications, resumes, cover letters. We do everything we can in the classroom to make sure that they get into a college. Um, as far as college preps, um, I'm pretty hands-on with it, especially with the, the college counselors that we have here. Um, I feel like they pave the way. And we also offer a number of dual credit classes, which really allows them to transition easier to the college level. Dual classes were really helping me, AP classes were helping me, and those classes actually prepared me for college as well. Now I feel like I am ready to actually face those challenges. CYSB is a concept young Scholars program. It's basically a program for extracurricular activities. So it's basically community service, extracurriculars, personal physical activities, and college visits, scholarship, uh, and, and application and stuff you apply to. You just do meetings, you can do your homework, you just log things, and it's like a week, other every other week thing. But it just really sets you up for a position for success. It helps you grow as a character. We've gone on the Feed My Starving Children program. And I really loved like the service that I was doing, so now like I know that it's something that I want to continue doing in my future. I did basically a lot of community services, like we went to feed my starving children and we packed food there. I know the colleges also look for your academic performance, but they also look for extracurriculars. In CYSP, I encourage me to join a lot of extracurricular activities. It helps create a connection with the students in that program, as well as the teachers. So you're going to explore different places, you're going to help out your community, you're going to engage in your activities. And really the point is to create those relationships that they currently have with others and also with the teachers and staffs. In CMS, the teachers, they don't expect everybody to be on the same pace. They help you individually because everybody is different and unique and we all have our strengths and weaknesses so they work with you to overcome any struggles you're facing and they also work with you to use your strengths and powers in, in ways that you can utilize them and use them in your careers or do something with them in future. I mean, you're only as good as the people you surround yourself by, so if you're all looking to achieve something super powerful, you know, it's best to surround the people that do so as well. We are one of the top charter schools in Illinois. Our students are always doing well, they're always getting into good schools. We've had students that have gone to Brown University, Northwestern, Naval Academy. Recently, too, one of our seniors got accepted into Princeton. Um, Warda, so we're so happy for her and excited for her. Those uh, relationships that I built with my teacher over the years have not just going to stay with me through my high school journey, they're going to stay with me through my entire life. Even if I go to college, if I need something from them, I will still be in contact with them. Mm -hmm.